video on Google Vault. Uh, in this video, what we're going to cover is reports and the auditing within reports. Reports is used fundamentally to see what people have done within Vault. So these aren't matters, these aren't archiving emails. This is just seeing who's accessed what data. And this can be useful for a myriad of reasons, but really what it comes down to is who's looking at our data and should they be looking at our data. So we're going to go from the bot bottom up and just kind of discuss what they are. So chat migration holds, group holds, user holds, and domain holds. These are all specific to holds that you've created. So chat migration holds, I don't have any chat holds, I don't have any group holds, but you can set holds by groups and then anything that is set that way you can search through here and then user holds. So here's the two user holds that I currently have um, and you can look at that and access the data and see what it was and then you can even edit the hold. But that takes you into the hold itself. So let's click back into our vault, open up reports again, you can see domain holds. This is for everyone within the domain. It applies to all the users and then at the top right as always you can download as a CSV and then audit. This is the main functionality of reports. This is really what you're looking for. This is saying who accessed our data. And as you can see on the right here, search, export, document view, hold, matter, saved query, retention, and audit. These are the actions that you can take within Vault. And you can either select all to pull everything or you can say, hey, I just want to know who's searching between specific dates and I'm just going to say everyone and it will download as a CSV you can open it up in sheets and see who was looking for different information you can also do it by user so I want to do Lisa and I want to add Ryan Boom. so now this is going to say alright what did Lisa and Ryan between July 1st and 9th search for in Vault and it will download that as a CSV and you'll be able to see everything that I looked for and, and that Lisa looked for uh, you can see what people exported, the documents they viewed, holds that they created or edited or worked within, um, matters that they created, edited, or worked within, saved queries, so any saved searches they want to run again, uh, any editing of retention rules, and then anything within audit itself. Uh, so you can actually see who's searching through the audit function as well. Uh, so reports is a great tool uh, it's used on the back end exclusively for vault but it's definitely something that can be useful if you think someone's accessing data that they shouldn't have or you want to make sure that they were pulling the correct data or that it was pulled when the request was made hope you learned something thanks for watching